good afternoon everyone just let me know in the chat box if you can hear me properly so we can start with the session Okay, great. Uh, thank you for the confirmation. So we can start with the session. So again, a very good afternoon, everyone. On Sunday afternoon, you are putting efforts to sit for a session. So I really appreciate that. Okay. So basically, we have one good news already. Many students uh, might have got that information from college training and placement officer. And also we have posted yesterday on our Instagram channel as well that DXC technology has started with its on-campus drive. Okay, it is on campus drive. Usually the off campus drive is conducted later on. So this particular drive is for 2024 batch students. Also, one more important thing, whatever topics which are important, syllabus, what exactly is the pattern, what are the instructions, like whether there is any negative marking or not, we are going to discuss everything, okay, one by one. Now, if you are new to this particular channel, if you have not subscribed to our channel, make sure you subscribe because in upcoming days, we are going to have many new updates, okay, along with the placement preparation material. So make sure you uh, subscribe to our channel as well. Now, what I will do, uh, whatever general questions you are having, guys, I will cover all those questions at the end. Initially, I will continue with the syllabus or with the presentation that I have created. Okay. So I'm Ajinkya Gulkarni. I'm co-founder of Talent Battle. Okay. Talent Battle is a one-stop platform for the placement preparation where we provide all type of training, aptitude, technical, interview preparation, company specific, latest technology and many more things. Okay. Now yesterday when we posted a poll on Instagram that how many uh, students are having a uh, DXC technology, okay. As on-campus drive. So around 35 to 40 percentage of the students said that they are having this particular drive. So that is a good thing. Now, one more important thing I would like to tell, please don't take any opportunity lightly, uh, those whatever opportunities you are going to uh, get in next one or two months, because already we know the opportunities are less compared to previous year compared to 2022 or 2023 batch. So if the opportunities are going to less, you cannot take the opportunities lightly, like even like DXC technologies or Accenture. So make sure you prepare really well for them and you try to get that particular opportunity. Okay. So let us start with the syllabus. Okay. Now, one important thing I would like to mention the points that I'm going to share right now, okay, are based on the previous year drive. So whatever information we get from the thousands of students who attempt the exam, DXC technology, okay. So whatever information they share regarding pattern, regarding important topics, number of questions. So we get that data and we share it with you. Also, we get some data from college training and placement officers as well. So we share that information also. But there can be some minor changes, okay. If there are some minor changes when DXC actually starts with 2024 drive, we will let you know immediately. We will update that on our Instagram channel as well, okay. Okay. So let us start. So what exactly we are going to discuss? We are going to discuss about the previous year pattern. Okay. Which is most likely to be followed uh, same. Okay. Which is going to be same this year as well. Okay. If there are minor changes, we will let you know. Also, what are the important topics or concepts for each section? There are different sections which are going to be there in DXC exam. So what are they and how you can prepare for them? how to prepare for each section and then general strategy and tips that we will be discussing. Okay. Now, I hope you can see this particular uh, page. Okay. This particular table on the screen. What is the pattern of DXC technologies? Okay. So as you can check, there are multiple sections for DXC technology. The first section is quantitative ability. Second is logical, then English. So you can say general aptitude, three different sections are going to be there quant, logical and verbal, or you can say English ability. Then there are going to be technical MCQ questions on computer programming, automata fix and essay writing. So if we check recently, we have created videos for TCS, Accenture, even we have posted some different videos <coughs> related to other companies, Hexaware as well. 
essay writing was not part earlier of other companies which we have posted but for dxc technology usually they are going to ask you essay writing question as well now for each and every section we are going to discuss in detail so you don't need to worry about that just check the number of questions and timing which is allocated okay so for quantitative ability you are going to have 16 questions 16 minutes so one minute for each question it is not question uh, uh like per question you are not going to get a timer it is a total timer that you are going to get okay so it is not like tcs paid in qt exam that per question you are having a fixed time okay it is not going to happen like that logical ability 14 questions 14 minutes english there are going to be 12 questions for 15 minutes now if you ask me about the difficulty level of the exam the difficulty level of the questions for aptitude is easy to medium Okay, so it is not like they are going to ask you advanced question because if you check for each question, they are going to provide you around one minute only. So in one minute, you can solve easy to medium level questions. But again, for that, you need to have good foundation level knowledge of aptitude. That is important. Okay. Now, next is computer programming. You are going to have 12 questions for 15 minutes. Automata fix, maybe this is something new to some students. Okay, we are going to discuss about that. So there are going to be seven questions for 20 minutes. Okay, and then essay writing one essay writing topic will be given to you for 20 minutes. Now, maybe you can put that put in chat box like when exactly you are going to have DXC exam. So accordingly, we can plan if you are having exam after 25 to 30 days. Okay, now then in case of aptitude, I would recommend you to first go through the important topics and their foundation concepts. Okay, same with the computer programming uh, and other parts as well, which I have mentioned. Okay. Uh, Pushkaraj is asking, it is not visiting our college. How can I apply? It is on campus drive right now. Okay. So what I'm saying, if you have exam in just next 10 to 12 days, okay, like uh, as information shared by some of the students, some students are having exam in August first week. Okay. So if the exam is again in just eight to 10 days, you cannot focus too much on the foundation training concepts. You do not have that much time. So what you need to do, you directly need to target those topics which are previously asked. Okay. And then you need to continue with the preparation. For other students who are having 20 to 25 days, you can learn the topic, you can, uh, you can practice the shortcuts, concepts, everything, and then you can solve the previous year DXC questions. Okay. Now let us go to the next part. Now last year, the exam was conducted on MCAT platform. So even if you check, Wipro usually conducts the exam on MCAT platform. So usually the pattern of Wipro is also quite same. Yes, a small minor changes are there. Okay. But on MCAT platform, difficulty level of the question is like uh, easy to medium. Okay. So you don't need to worry about difficulty level. You need to think about the time management. Okay. And for that, you need to understand, you need to solve many questions. Okay. So let us continue with the next slide. Now let us check what are the important topics. I hope you have taken the screenshot of the last slide guys. Okay. So if you need it for the future reference, you can take a screenshot in between. It will help you later on. Okay. So I will go to the next slide. Now, what are the important topics for quantitative ability for quant? As we have checked, you are going to have 16 questions for 16 minutes. Now, as you can check on the screen, I have mentioned the important topics. Okay. So you can take a screenshot. Okay. So what are the topics? Statistics, quadratic equations, ratio proportions, simplification, number system, time work, time speed distance, probability, profit loss, average percentage, SICI, HCF, LCM and logarithm. If you check in general aptitude in quant, we have like total aptitude, we have like 35 to 45 topics. But right now, if you have less time, like as one student is mentioning that you are uh, like he's having exam in August first week. Okay. So if the exam is in August first week, you cannot cover all the topics, right? So what you should do, you should just focus on the topics, which I have mentioned on the screen and practice questions from those topics. Okay. Suppose for one particular topic, if you don't know the concept, maybe in that case, you can check the foundation video of that particular topic, like how to solve questions based on that topic. What are the shortcuts? What are the maybe concepts? Okay. And then some practice these questions if you check topics are mostly general topics okay like time work time speed distance probability profit loss average percentage so even if you are preparing for tcs even if you are preparing for hexaware kind of companies almost the topics are same okay so it will definitely help you Again, whatever information I'm sharing, it is based on the experiences of the students who have given the previous exams. Okay. 
okay so this particular syllabus is for the quantitative ability now let us go to the next slide guys okay next slide is logical reasoning now for logical reasoning if you check you are going to have 14 questions 14 minutes and the topics are quite easy okay like odd man out blood relation coding decoding data sufficiency analogy data interpretation they will be providing you some uh, table and questions based on that and directions uh, directional sense and series so the topics are easy just you need to make sure uh, like you have solved similar kind of questions based on these topics and then practice some mock tests. That is also important. Again, if you want, you can take a screenshot that will be helpful to you later on. OK, now English for English ability to solve questions based on that. You need to have good command over grammatical concepts. OK, so if you are not uh, confident about your grammatical concepts, you may find this particular section challenging. OK, whatever experiences students have shared previously. So what type of questions you are going to have? You are going to have questions based on reading comprehension. OK, some paragraph will be given and you need to answer the questions. Sentence completion sentence improvement error spotting okay and in sentence improvement what they usually do they will provide you some sentence in which there are some mistakes okay and you need to correct those mistakes so last year as per the information which was shared by the students okay more number of questions were based on sentence improvement sentence completion okay so if you have not practiced those questions enough okay just make sure you go through them okay it will help you now one student is asking about the lpa the LPA is around 4.2, 4.5 for DXC, at least whatever information shared by the previous students. Okay. So again, you can check on the screen. These are the important topics of English. Okay. So right now we have discussed about quant logical verbal. Yes, it is around 4.2 LPA. Okay. That you are going to get. Now, next, discuss, let us discuss about the questions which are based on automata fix. So can you tell me any one of you have gone through the uh, like questions uh, related to automata fix earlier? Okay. So we can discuss that. Just let me know if you have gone through any details of automata fix. Yes. So what are the important topics that are required for automata fix? Okay. As you can check on the screen, you need to have knowledge of fundamentals of programming. Okay. Which are like, uh, like array strings, recursion, function, flow control, link list graph. Now usually they provide you multiple language options ccpp java is there but as per some of the students earlier uh python was also provided but c c plus plus java definitely it is going to be there okay just let give me one moment guys yes so what type of questions basically you are going to have whenever you are going to solve automata fix questions related to code reuse okay questions related to code debugging there will be some logical errors in the question Okay, and that you need to change and then uh, you should be able to continue with that particular code. Okay, so that type of questions you are going to have as you can check on the screen. Okay, the questions related to uh, like you need to have knowledge of flow control link list graph. Let me check the comments as well. Yeah, okay, so that concept you need to have what I will do. Okay, what I will do is okay. I, we will put you or we will create a separate video of automata fix questions for DXC technology. So those students who do not have any idea about uh, automata fix section, we will be creating a separate video. So later on, maybe today or tomorrow, we will post that particular video that will be helpful to you. Okay. So if you have not subscribed, just subscribe to the video. So we, uh, you will get the update related to that. And also, if you're liking the efforts that our team is continuously taking on Instagram, on YouTube and on different channels, just make sure you like that video. It will motivate us to do more work. OK, so this is about the automata fix. OK, now computer programming. Now, regarding computer programming, there are multiple topics for which you need to work on. OK, so the questions are usually based on, as you can check on the screen, programming fundamentals, data types, operators, arrays, functions, pointers, basics of operating system as well, basics of data structure as well. OK, and the other uh, sections or other topics that I have mentioned. OK, now again, one more important thing. Uh, uh, one student is saying even two years completed our senior also not getting offer letters offer letter related problem to be honest Pranay is happening with multiple companies it does not mean uh, that students should not prepare for a particular company we already know due to recession many companies are either revoking or they are delaying the offer letter 
so it should uh, the, your mindset should not be that okay my seniors have not got the offer letter so i should not prepare for this particular company already the opportunities are going to be less and if the situation improves in next 6 to 8 months okay then definitely companies will start rolling out the offer letter as well okay so don't be into that mindset that my seniors are still waiting okay should i study or not you need to prepare really well you need to convert each and every opportunity that you are going to get okay let me continue with the next part guys essay writing now essay writing okay uh, on the amcat platform usually what they do they will provide you the word limit of 400 okay so 20 minutes is the usual time that they provide now structure of essay is also important okay now what do i mean by structure so suppose if any topic is given to you okay you need to have some introduction part maybe three to four lines then pros of that particular topic cons of that topic like advantages and disadvantages of that particular topic and at the end there should be some short conclusion that is like a structure of i say if you keep writing randomly okay that will create a problem definitely they are going to have automatic system to uh, check each and everything okay so what they usually do whenever the system is checking your essay writing they try to find out the keywords okay so based on keywords also they will provide you some marks also one more important thing whenever you are writing online essay okay you need to use correct grammar what you can do you can create some small sentences rather than creating difficult big sentences try to create some small sentences so probability of doing mistake uh, will definitely reduce okay so try to use correct grammar and punctuation that is also important avoid spelling mistake very important okay don't use your sms language or whatsapp language okay make sure you are uh, writing it completely and the length as i mentioned it should be around 400 words now last time just to give you idea what type of topics they have asked previously okay one of the topic was like uh, do you prefer village life or do you prefer uh, like uh, city life so what are the pros of uh, or what are the cons of city life versus uh, village life okay also there was one topic like how you are going to manage your work life balance whenever you will join the company so the topics are not going to be difficult topics okay topics are going to be easy just keep one thing in mind that you need to properly do a create a structure short introduction of the topic pros or advantages then disadvantages and then the conclusion okay and even if we get some more topics we will let you know on instagram like whatever recent topics they are going to ask will we keep uh, we will keep updating those topics on our instagram 2024 channel okay so this is about essay writing now, if you check again, all the sections, I will just go back. Okay. So all the sections, quant, logical, English, computer programming, automata fix and essay writing. Now, if you are having like 20 to 30 days or even eight to 10 days, your preparation will differ a bit for eight to 10 days student directly. I will uh, I ask you to uh, start practicing the previous year questions as you do not have that much time. If your exam is in August, second week or third week, you can learn these topics and then practice the previous year questions okay so that will be also sufficient for dxc okay now how to prepare for each section ideally ideally how you should prepare first you need to do foundation preparation of aptitude and programming concepts first learn the concepts and then you need to solve previous year questions of dxc technologies from aptitude automata fix computer programming mcq okay you also need to practice essay writing okay if you are not comfortable writing a uh, big essays uh, online you need to do practice for that as well okay so this is the ideal practice but those students who have exam in next eight to ten days i would suggest you to directly start with the dxc specific questions okay now how we can help you with the dxc preparation i will cover that part as well okay but before that some important points i will let you know at least last year okay or whatever exams they have covered uh, so far there was no negative marking for dxc exam but again let me tell you very uh, important thing okay make sure you go through the instructions before the exam because if dxc technologies decides to change it okay and if you go blindly okay there is no negative marking and i will attempt each and everything that can create a problem at least till now there was no negative marking but just make sure before the exam you read the instruction also one important thing you cannot revisit the question according to the previous year rule so once you click on that question or once you skip that question you will go to the next slide 
okay so make sure since you cannot revisit the question since there is no negative marking make sure you tick it every time okay so rather than skipping the question it will be better to tick okay so based on your uh like maybe luck if you don't know either you will get a mark or you will lose a mark okay cannot navigate between different sections according to the previous year pattern so basically you cannot go to the previous question or next question uh, like randomly to any question or uh, randomly to any section okay you need to go one by one okay for each question again on the screen i have shown the table okay if you want you can take a screenshot okay again one important line i have mentioned if there are any changes that we come to know from the students we will immediately update you okay now next how we can help you with the preparation okay so definitely uh as you know in our master class we keep on taking different company specific training okay so dxc is also part of our company specific module okay so dxc specific training for the master class batch is starting from tomorrow that is 24 july because already the time is less okay so what exactly we are going to cover into that i will mention that okay so yes there is one discount coupon code as well which is right now we are having the coupon code is new batch and there is flat 15 percentage discount now in master class what you are going to get okay let me quickly cover if you are having absolute zero knowledge of aptitude and technical we try to cover the syllabus in next 30 to 35 days okay from basics so dxc specific student if you have time you can attend those sessions suppose if you do not have time already to from tomorrow we are directly starting with the previous year questions of dxc okay and not only dxc we are already conducting training for uh, hexaware pcs accenture zs associates okay so different company specific trainings are going on and whenever new companies will be launching okay we will be taking their training as well so in master class you get entire end to end aptitude preparation training live sessions as well as recordings of those sessions c cpp java python dsa everything is covered there are 25 plus companies service based and product based companies that we cover and regarding certifications if you want to do certifications in full stack data science iot or maybe mongodb maybe uh, django or maybe uh, any other technology that i have mentioned okay you will be getting certification courses of that you'll be getting almost 25 plus projects based on latest technologies and programming languages and then important core computer subjects like computer networks then operating system database management okay all the subjects will be there and the most important thing is interview preparation again my request to all the students please do not take the interview preparation lightly what happens many students put a lot of effort on uh, the initial part the aptitude and then the technical and they do not practice the interview skills enough and that is the reason we do conduct technical interview guidance sessions personal interview guidance session and we take one-to-one -one mock technical one-to-one -one mock personal interview of the students so that is the content overall of the master class now uh, right now also we are running with the fast track batches okay so for 2024 batch we recommend that uh, like right now you need to study four to five hours okay even all those students who do not have dxc technology right now tcs is like there are updates that tcs may launch anytime okay so please do not waste the time if you're having right now free time make sure you start with the preparation immediately okay you can join the master class anytime there is uh, the content which i have mentioned on the screen that you can check okay now what is the roadmap that we usually follow in the uh, master class we start with the aptitude and programming preparation we work on your profile building and certifications along with that company specific training your mock interviews and you need to continue your preparation till you get success that is very important okay now uh there are uh again the important content okay 25 plus companies that i have mentioned on the screen now one more thing all the 2023 or previous batch students suppose if you do not have time to attend the live sessions already each and every content is available on your dashboard in a recorded format okay and 2024 students seen if you want to attend the live sessions you can attend that if you don't want to attend live session you want to watch the recordings you can do that we have dedicated doubt uh, specific groups okay with the technical trainer as well as aptitude trainer you get certification like that after you complete each and every course okay these are the technologies that we cover in the master class I will quickly cover the dashboard demo before that i will quickly tell you the prior fees okay three uh, there are different validities for which you can go for three months validity website price is 24.99 but since i have provided you coupon code of 15 percentage you can go for 21 24. now if you check with the other platforms other platform charges like 4000 6000 10000 rupees 
the best possible content in a live session. We are the only platform to take dedicated live sessions in a structured format. So if you're looking for it, you can go, you can start with the price of maybe three months later on. If you want to up upgrade it, you can do that. If you want to uh, purchase this particular masterclass with your friends, okay, then uh, definitely you get it at low price, almost 25 percentage discount. Okay. So we have buddy offer. You can just send us message. I mean, just send us a contact number as well. Okay. 84599. Okay. So maybe students can directly call if they're having any doubt. If you want to take further validities, you can use that as well. Just one more inform information with 24 months validity, we are providing TCS paid NQT subscription as well. Okay. So since we are having a connection with, uh, we are connected with TCS ION for the paid NQT exam, you can utilize that. Okay. Now, uh, this is the story. Okay. Uh, like we have helped thousands of students uh, so far in this particular placement journey. We have recently uh, like completed our 10 years of uh, like a, a startup. Okay. Now quickly, I will share you the demo. Just give me one particular moment. Okay. Just give me one moment. Let me share the screen. But till then, if you're having any questions, guys, you can ask. Okay. We will cover those questions. Just give me one moment. Okay. This is the dashboard demo. Okay. I will quickly give you the demo because many of you might have already seen that. Okay. Also one more important thing, complete masterclass students, you do not uh, like need to register again separately for this. You already have each and every company on your dashboard. Do not pay money again. Okay. You already have this training. Okay. So from tomorrow we are starting quickly. I will go through the aptitude part. Okay. On the dashboard. On the dashboard, as you can check, there are multiple courses, complete aptitude training. So whatever topics I have shown you earlier, guys, okay, suppose for example, uh, you are going to have questions related to statistics. You are going to have questions related to percentage profit loss. So all these topics are already available on your dashboard. These are going to be covered live already. You have all the topics, even if you have zero knowledge of aptitude, zero knowledge of technical, it does not matter. You just need to be ready to take the efforts. You need to be sincere. You need to be honest with yourself. If you are ready to do that, then definitely we are ready to help you with the placement preparation. Okay. Now, uh, these are the aptitude topics as you can check. Along with that, extra practice questions are also available for each and every topic. We have created additional practice questions video. You can go through them. Ultimate M is you don't need to refer any other book, any other YouTube video, any other platform, whatever you need for the placement preparation. It is there on your dashboard. Okay. Same way. Suppose if you're not confident about grammatical skills. We have created a simple video course where we are going to teach you about tenses, where we are going to teach you about active voice, passive voice, direct speech, indirect speech. Everything is covered over there. Okay. So you can go through this. It will help you for verbal ability because for Capgemini also verbal ability round is very important and it is usually challenging for the students. So if you are not confident about your grammar skills, you can go through this particular course. Okay. In technical courses, we have C, C++, Java, Python, in also DSA available in each and every language. We have computer networks, operating system, database courses starting from basics to advanced. Also 100 days coding sheet, we can say, okay, that we have. So we have 100 days statements. One by one, you can go through from basic level to advanced level for the coding practice as well. Okay. Now in company specific training, I will cover, you can check all the companies that we have. We have Zoho, we have TCS for TCS. We have three separate courses. Okay. Infosys, Cognizant, LTI, DXC preparation. So just check for DXC preparation. We already have so much material, which is already ready. So you can check already. There are 35 to 37 modules, which are ready on your dashboard. Apart from this, we are going to have additional live sessions. So, so just imagine you can check all the questions like automata fix, verbal ability. So many automata fix related videos are already available on the dashboard. Then aptitude, quant, logical, verbal related videos are already available. So one thing you don't need to refer anything. You just need to go through each and every video on dashboard. Along with this, we are going to have questions uh, live as well. We have also created one important document for DXC specific interview questions. These are interview questions which are usually asked by DXC. Similarly, we have other companies in the resume preparation, interview preparation. We have given you guidance about how to tackle personal interview questions, technical interview questions, resume preparation. We cross check and verify your resume with the experts and then essay writing. So suppose if you're not confident about essay writing skills, we do have essay writing related guidance video and we have essay writing test series as well. So you can go through those tests also. Apart from that additional, as I mentioned, 25 plus projects available pro, uh, like programming skills, latest technologies, 
And in latest technology, we have full stack, data science, IoT. Then you can check robotics, AWS, MongoDB. Different technologies are there. So whatever you need to prepare for the placement and upskill, everything is covered. And last but not the least is mock test. So for each and every aptitude topic, for each and every, we can say technical concept, we have the test series, DXC specific test series are also there, TCS test series, technical mock test series like C, CPP, Java, Python database, all the tests are available over here. Okay. So again, just you need to be ready to put the efforts. That is very important. Okay. So again, if you need more information, maybe you can just uh, like type DXC talent battle, you will get the information. Okay. So we have added the syllabus and everything on this particular screen as well. Okay. So you can go through this particular screen. Any other question, just let me know in the chat box so I can cover guys. Or if you have any question about Accenture or any other company, do let me know. I will cover that. Okay. Just let me know about that. Or if you're having any question about maybe uh, like a uh, masterclass, you can ask that as well. I mean, just reshare the link. Okay. Yes. Just let me check if there are any questions. Okay. One more thing. Uh, sometimes what happens if there are any important internship updates or any hiring updates, we quickly post that on our uh, Instagram as well. So if you are not subscribed to our Instagram channel, we quickly update all the important opportunities over there. Okay. So make sure you follow us over there as well. And also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Okay. So I guess there are no questions. So I can end this particular session. If you want to talk with our mentor, Amit has already posted the number over there. Okay. You can directly call on that particular call on that particular number not only specific to dxc but maybe accenture maybe tcs or any other company if you're having queries or if you're having queries about the master class you can connect with us over there okay again from tomorrow we are starting with the dxc specific training just to give you information right now we are we have already started with accenture tcs zs associates hexa where we have conducted many sessions Along with that, general aptitude, Java related training, CPP related training, computer networks training, also MongoDB, data science, multiple things we are doing right now. Okay. So you can choose, you can take a decision what you want to prepare and you can continue with the journey. The most important thing is please start with the preparation rather than regretting later on. Okay. It is very important to start early. Okay. So with this, I will end this particular session. If you have any queries, please connect with us. Okay. Uh, like on Instagram, you can connect or you can directly call us. Thank you and all the best with the preparation. Thank you.